Hey guys, Craig Dweller here. How you doing? So it's Friday morning. Um, I'm heading up to the White Mountains solo. I had some time, a little bit of time this weekend, so I'm getting away. Uh, I'm not going to be summoning any uh, 4,000 footers. My left knee is still tweaked out, so I got to give it some more time to do any uh, serious climbing. But I am going to do an out and back. I'm going to go to a place. Uh, it's called Sawyer Pond in the White Mountains, off of Route 112. Never been there. It looks beautiful. Um, a friend of mine's been there. Said it's good. It's awesome. There's some. There's a some tent sites and tent platforms around the pond. So I'm going to try to find somewhere tonight to uh, set up camp. It is raining, but I think it's supposed to let up around two in the afternoon today. So we'll see. Make the best of it. So yeah, it's just a four and a half mile hike in, and then tomorrow at some point I'll hike out. And uh, yeah, just getting away, relax, do some. You know some camping I got the hammock this time uh, so yeah that's about it for now I'll check in later peace so here we are it's uh, quarter after nine I'm at the soya pond trail trailhead you can see it there I'm the only one here. Awesome. Of course, it's a rainy Friday morning, although the rain has stopped for a minute, so that's good. I'd like to be, at least be able to set up not being in the rain. That'd be nice. All right, I'll, uh, I'll shoot some video as we get going here, or as I get going. So this is um, it's only like 200 feet from the trailhead. The, the trail comes down here. And you've got to you've got to ford this creek, this little stream. So I only know this because I saw it online. Somebody tried making a little dam thing there, but it's quite a jump. So there's a shallow spot right there. I just crossed right there. That's why I got the Crocs on and the and the pant legs off. But yeah, so now that's the first water crossing. I'm gonna dry my feet off, put my my trail runners on, and there's the trail up and out of here. I'm really glad the rain stopped. Setting up in the rain sucks. So hopefully it'll not be raining when I set up camp tonight. All right, see you in a bit. <clears throat> so this is just a one-nighter. Um, so I didn't bring a ton of food, just enough for dinner tonight, snacks and breakfast tomorrow. And I'm not an ultra light backpacker, just relatively lightweight. But just for the record, my pack weight, um, including my Hellenux chair, a luxury item for sure, um, my pack weight is 16 pounds, including food, but not including this liter of water. Um, so 16 pounds, including food, but again, it's only for one night, so. But I've got everything I need. Um, and that's the Sawyer Pond Trail going that way. What does this say? Two bridges are known. I washed out on the upper. Okay, I'm not going that way, so it's not an issue. But yeah, here we go. Well, I'll tell you what, it feels good to get the pack on again. Uh, it's a real first time I've had my pack on this this year, actually. Um, but yeah, it feels good. I just wish my knee was better, because I'd rather summon a mountain while I'm up here, but nonetheless, it's nice to get out. Just gorgeous. I wish you could smell the air. Absolutely fantastic. Especially with the rain, everything's fresh.
Really glad it stopped raining for a while. Wow, it is so humid. Check out this chaga. Sweet. You know, despite today's rain, you can tell how dry it's been. Actually, in all of New England this this summer, anyway. Like this this year is usually. I'm, I'm assuming it's usually flowing a little bit more than this, just by the geography you can tell and uh, a lot of the wet areas I've been walking through are normally probably got water standing in them but now they're, they're not dry but they're certainly not puddled up beautiful dense area though this is awesome so far the rain's holding off I got about another two miles to go and I'll be in there to Sawyer Pond all right. Coming up to the pond, you can see it through the trees. Very pretty area. <clears throat> the temperatures dropped. Um, like it was supposed to, uh, probably about 10 degrees, and it's breezy, yet gusty at times, so that's good. There's no bugs, of course, which is the best part about this time of year, so that's cool. And, uh, yeah, going to head on down to the pond here and check out the tent platforms and find a cool place to uh, spend the night. I can hear people, so that must mean that obviously somebody's there. All right, I'll see you in a bit. So I think I'm going to take this site. I'm surprised how many people are here. There's only two sites left open. There's seven tent platforms, and uh, the shelter, the shelter's taken. There's a big group of people here, young men, uh, partying. That's all good. Um, so this is site number six, seven. It's the last one before the shelter, which is over there. So tranquility, it's not going to be. I mean, there's no, but whatever. It's just a night away, right? The fire pit there. I'm not sure if I'll have a fire going. I'm trying to figure out an area where I can set my, set my hammock up. I think I might go right over the platform. Maybe from this tree to over there. So we'll see. The other sites, they don't really, um, if I had my tent, it'd be all set, but it doesn't really apply here. Um, I mean, this, the trees aren't really going to work out and on the other sites. I checked them out. But, uh, yeah, we'll see. This should be fun. <laughs> 